Freedom is something that all humans and creation aspire to have. I've always dreamt of flying, and so to me, freedom is flight. Making art is often inspired by a, you know, a single emotion. And, and today, that emotion was of bliss and of freedom. And I find that when I make art and music, I want to try to communicate that idea with an image. Often when I'm sketching, I'm really trying to search for an idea. I'm trying to find that hidden gem of a concept. And with this particular piece, I actually had the image pretty laid out in my head. I, I knew where I was going really early on. In fact, I had kind of dreamt of this image, but I, I didn't really have to come up with a lot of different concepts because I knew immediately what I wanted to do. Drawing is probably my favorite part about the whole creation process. I feel probably most at home when I'm drawing, and therefore it becomes my go-to. This year I've been trying a lot of different kind of pencils, and I've been really enjoying this mechanical pencil, and I'll link it to you in the description so that you can test it. So side note here, this was a really bad use of this tape. I do not recommend using this kind of tape for what I'm doing. But once again, I'm experimenting. I'm trying new things all the time. Now for this acrylic painting, I'm following a similar kind of approach that you would with oils, where you're starting with a lot of thin washes and then building up more opaquely as you go. And, and this is kind of similar to what I'm doing here. You can see I have some inks, some acrylic inks, and I'm laying them down in multiple layers to get these kind of nice little washes. So this paper is a watercolor paper on a board. Uh, I believe it's by Canson. I'll have to double check. I'll have it for you in the description, but you can do a lot of watercolor like washes on this piece. And so I wanted to give the atmospheric kind of perspective behind uh, these trees, all while kind of keeping this funky color uh, scheme going. With this painting, I wanted to explore kind of a singular idea singular feeling of freedom um, and of hope. And like I mentioned, freedom and flight are kind of intertwined for me. I, I used to dream a lot growing up, whether that was a daydream or actual dreams of, of, of flying. I, I always loved Peter Pan. And so I just wanted to create a piece that kind of brought this into, into life for me. And um, something about whenever I see birds, and the, the idea of these birds flying around and how free they are. Um, they can uh, fly from tree to tree with really no effort. When I was growing up, I, uh, we had a, a bird feeder outside of our, our house. And uh, sometimes I would actually go out and be with the birds. They would eat right out of my hands. And other times I would just watch them through our picture window. And one thing I noticed was that the birds are constantly moving and are constantly just enjoying their freedom. When I was real little, I remember standing there one time with a handful of bird seeds and these little chickadees coming up and eating right out of my hand. And I remember them being pretty tentative at first and then later on starting to realize that they could trust me and that they could con continue to eat. But they're always you know, very skittish and at any moment they could take off and just fly and be gone. And there's something about the, this idea of uh, that a bird can just move and cover so much ground so quickly and then fly up to the heavens and go somewhere else. And I, I just have always really loved that about birds. So my hope is that by seeing this painting and maybe even looking behind the scenes a little bit and how it was made, you can appreciate uh, the heart behind it. And that when you see it, you'll be reminded um, of freedom and, and of hope and that kind of childlike wonder that we all need to approach life with. And that if we approach life with childlike wonder, I think we can experience so much more that life has to, to give us. I've been recently kind of in this mode of enjoying making art more than I ever have before. And I feel less like spending time 
playing video games or, or on a screen. And I'd rather just enjoy um, making art. And so if this, if this painting uh, has, has stirred up something in your heart, uh, make sure to pick one up at the store. There'll be a link uh, below and uh, put it on your wall and be reminded of, of freedom's flight. And as always, remember that you are valuable and that you are loved. I'll see you next time.